very hard. One of the thunderclouds have gathered here toward the end of the day each and every day. That's just typical of Colorado this time of year. But it's really opened up now on the fans attending this wonderful event. I would say it's more like in the 60s all of a sudden. And here comes Hap. Hap Hansen is undaunted. And the developer wants to ride. We asked Hap about this horse and how sound it is. It seems like a nice course. I really like the course. It's got a nice flow to it and stuff. She's got some bigger jumps in here. Um, he's a little stronger going horse, so I've got to um, be careful I don't get him too riled up in the beginning, so I have some strength left at the begin at the end of it to keep him under control. But he's, um, he's very straightforward, very trustworthy, and um, I think it looks like a good course. Hap Hansen earlier riding America 7, one rail down, just four faults, and now on this sand-based arena, the footing will change significantly. Actually, the sand is the best kind of footing to have. If it's going to rain, there may uh, puddles may develop, but it will not get slippery as a grass field or mud would. And four faults at the 4B out of the Audi combination there. An 11-year-old horse has one win this year and finished second at Calgary. He was up in Spruce Meadows at the Pan-Canadian Cup. self say by breeding. I'm very impressed with, with his demeanor. He is so calm with all this going on. The people are running in all different directions. The wind is picked up. It's dark. It's raining. And developer and Hap are just cantering around like, like nothing's happening. In the eye of a storm, is Hap Hansen, the leading rider out west, sixth overall on the AGA circuit. And this might be, with the weather and all the adverse conditions factored in, our best ride today with just one rail down. He's putting on a show as Hap Hansen. Nicely over that 12 was no problem at all. And 13. Remarkable. Everything considered, Hap Hansen and the developer show those hearty souls that brave the weather what it takes to be a great one.